For this tutorial, I'm using Ion Volumizing Root Lift to add a little bit of volume to my roots for my extremely long, thick hair. I get the root lift as close to my scalp as possible and then I use my fingers to pull it up and let it air dry. I air dry it to the opposite side of my part. That way I can just flip it over and get that extra volume without any added heat. Now I'm going to take my hair straight up and spray it with water. Take the curler as close as I can to the roots to do what's called an on base curl. Then I'm just going to wrap the hair down the curler in a spiral motion. I'll take the net, open it up, grab hold of the curler and up over once, twice, and it's done. This will help the curls be closer to the top of your head. Next, we're just going to repeat the process of that on base curl go through all the curlers. Today I'm going to use eight curlers in my hair. So all eight curlers, four on the top, four on the bottom, and just keep repeating this process, creating that on base curl at each section. There are other ways you can section the top of your hair to not include the part and get lots of volume at your roots. However, this is the style that I feel most comfortable with. So that is what I am showing you today for a more modern volume curl look. So this is basically all you'll need to do to get as much volume and lift in your hair with cozy curlers as you can. This does work better on shorter lengths of hair. I can tell you that. We're going to do a few extra things at the end to help increase volume because there's not much more that you can do while you're wrapping them. So we're just going to continue this process, wrapping it, putting the nets over the top. I think we're on our last one at the bottom. So notice on these bottom ones, I'm not doing an on base curl, but I'm still wrapping as close to the roots as I can. That's it, now I just gotta wait for them to dry. Okay, so the next day or a few hours later, just take your curlers out. I'm going to roll them down instead of pulling them down. So see how I'm unraveling them one at a time? This will help create a smoother curl. So I'm just gonna roll it out. Mm, they're so bouncy. I love this look. Oh, this one I'm having struggles with. And that'll happen once in a while. No matter how good you wrap it. But don't worry, we can fix it. See that? Just gonna take it, wrap around your finger. Voila. It's all good now. Okay, next one. So we're just gonna take it out. Another big bouncy curl. All right, we're just gonna roll this one out just like the other ones. Mm, so good. And then we got two left. This one. There we go, nice and bouncy. Last one. This is our piece that we really tried to get a little bit of extra volume in. And there is a little bit more lift than what I would usually have because I have really thick and heavy hair, even with my small amount of layers I have in there, it still has a hard time getting volume, which is why I thought it'd be good for me to do this video. So what I'm gonna do next is just run my fingers through the top of my hair near my roots, pulling it out, trying to get that extra lift at the top. Right here would be a good spot to add a little bit of hairspray near those roots to keep it up. So this is the result without any teasing or anything else. I'm gonna fix one piece of hair. There you go, that's all you have to do to fix a weird curl, is just redirect it. And then, these are the results. Okay, so if you want extra volume, you can always tease the roots, so use a brush, a pick, or a comb, and just try to get your hair ratted right next to the roots. And honestly, I am not the pro at ratting hair. That is my mom who was a hairstylist during the 80s. She is great at ratting roots. I tried to get as many tips from her before I made this video, but I am not the best. So please don't judge me too hard. But this is as good as I could do. Um, I definitely have some volume. I combed it out to smooth out those ratted pieces and I'm just gonna twirl my finger around some pieces that got a little messy when I ratted them. These volumizing tips will work better on shorter lengths of hair as well as layered haircuts. Please remember that the products you use and your haircut and hair type will have an effect 
on your curls, but I hope these tips helped.